requires decent wind and rain protection around the knees and upper body, and although the mid-height screen isn't adjustable, buffeting is kept to a minimum at motorway speeds. The seat is comfy on long stints and the neutral riding position is friendly for tall and short riders alike. Despite not having fully adjustable suspension and weighing as much as the Moon, 254 kg, the 1250S boasts decent handling and is surprisingly agile on the move. The steering is light, there's ample ground clearance for fast road riding and it feels unflappable at speed. One concession to the 21st century is the addition of ABS. This is a basic system though, not the advanced cornering ABS seen on many new bikes. Propelling the Bandit's mass is a 1255cc liquid-cooled fuel-injected dock engine knocking out 97 bhp and 80 ftlb of torque. A secondary balancer shaft keeps things smooth. Suzuki's Dual Throttle Valve SDTV, Digital Closed Loop Fuel Injection gives superb throttle response, improved mileage and reduced emissions.